When it comes to having a break, being able to access all your favorite content is more important than ever, and these days, with many theaters being closed, we often go to the cinema at home. The new Mi TV Stick is a smart portable streaming media player running Google system and having Chromecast built in. I brought it with me on my last holiday and it saved the day when the weather was bad outside and we couldn't go to the beach because there was no cable TV and watching on the phone was an option, but a bigger screen is always better. The Mi TV Stick is lightweight, portable and very simple to use. Connect it to the HDMI port on the TV, give it some power and grab the smart remote you're going to be amazed by all the features that it offers. If you've ever had Android TV at home, you're going to know about this interface, but even if you have no experience at all, the tile-based interface is so easy to use. Let me show you the remote first. It's a smart remote, and right away you can notice the dedicated Amazon Prime Video and Netflix buttons, and streaming services are well integrated with the Mi TV Stick. Running your favorite TV show is now just a button away, and because it's official Android TV edition, there are all the needed certifications to enjoy your shows in full HD resolution. But that's only part of it. Open Play Store and you have access to all your favorite apps. This also includes games. And if you have Bluetooth joystick laying around, pretty great setup for having some fun. The Quad-Core CPU, accompanied by 1GB RAM, is good enough hardware to let you play most of the available games in Play Store which do not require intensive graphics. There also is 5G Wi-Fi, so downloading large files won't take that much time. Do you see this button? Let's try it together. It's enabling Google Assistant, works just like on your smartphone. Say out loud what you wish Google Assistant to do for you and see the progress on the screen. Open Netflix. And since I mentioned it's vacation time, let's see some of these photos. Google Chromecast. It's integrated. Open Photos, select Cast. And there it is on your TV. That was super easy, right? Introducing Roku Streaming Stick Plus. Powerful and portable. Enjoy brilliant HD and 4K picture quality plus vivid HDR color. The long range wireless receiver delivers up to four times the range, so you can stream in rooms further from your router. Take it with you when you travel. It's smooth streaming made easy no matter where you're watching. The voice remote has everything you need, including buttons for TV power, volume and mute. Enjoy free TV, live news, sports, movies across thousands of channels. No monthly equipment fees or contracts required. Search across top streaming channels with your voice. Search action movies and then see your results ranked by price. For high performance, portability and long range wireless, Roku Streaming Stick Plus delivers it all at an amazing value. There's a Roku player for everyone. You can control your Fire TV Cube with hands-free Alexa voice commands, the Alexa voice remote or the Amazon Fire TV app. Use a compatible device to search the App Store for Fire TV app, then follow the instructions to download. Use the five-way directional trackpad on your remote to move up, down, left, or right. Press the Select button in the middle to choose a content item, function, or category. Select Home to return to the home screen or say, Alexa, go home. Use the Menu button to view more options for your current selection. Select Back to return to the previous screen or action, or say, Alexa, go back. Media controls let you rewind, play, pause, and fast-forward video. Press Menu during video playback to turn on subtitles or change the audio language. Use Alexa Voice Remote to interact with your device, search for content, play videos, launch apps, and more. Press and hold the voice button, wait for the tone, then speak. You can use your voice to search for movies, music, games, apps, and TV shows such as The Marvelous Mrs. Maisel. When you finish speaking, release the voice button. Your Fire TV then searches your library, Amazon, and compatible apps to find what you're looking for. You'll need to access content from some providers directly within the provider's app. 
You can filter search results by selecting a content tab, such as movies and TV, at the top of your selected search results. If you use hands-free Alexa voice commands to do a search, you see numbered options on screen. You can say things like, Alexa, pick number one, and this selects the corresponding first numbered selection displayed on screen. In addition to search, you can also use your voice to play videos and launch apps. For videos, just say play, followed by the title of the movie or TV show you want to start watching. For apps, say launch, followed by the title of the app or game you want to open. Your Fire TV also features Amazon Alexa. With Alexa, you can get music, news, weather, information, and more just by speaking. With hands-free Alexa voice commands, say the wake word and then ask your question. Alexa, what time is it in New York City? You can also press and hold the voice button on the Alexa voice remote, wait for the tone, and then ask your question. How's the weather in Seattle? Learn more about using Alexa on Fire TV at amazon.com forward slash help forward slash Fire TV forward slash Alexa. Use the menu at the top of the screen to view your content, shop for new content, and access settings. Don't worry about turning off your Amazon Fire TV Cube when you are finished using it. It will enter sleep mode automatically while continuing to receive important software updates in the background. You can wake your Amazon Fire TV Cube by pressing any button on the remote. If you do need to turn off your device for any reason, simply unplug the power cord. This is the NVIDIA Shield. Building on everything we've learned from Android TV, today, I am really excited to introduce Google TV. Google makes it so easy for anyone to enter something they're looking for and find results right away. That's the same experience we want to recreate on Google TV. A whole new approach whose aim is to deliver an entertaining and personal experience with recommendations and a discovery paradigm made just for you. For example, I'm a huge fan of dramas. I would usually look within all my different apps to figure out what should I watch. But with Google TV, I'll see a row of tailored recommendations from across all my favorite streaming subscriptions, all in one place, making it way faster to find something to watch. How many times has it happened to you that someone tells you about a great movie to watch or a great show to watch, and you're on the street and you want to remember the name, but you've forgotten it by the time you've gotten home? Happens to me all the time. 
Another great feature that we brought to Google TV is a watch list, which gives you one easy place to bookmark movies and shows that you want to save for later. You can even add to your watch list from your phone or your laptop, and it'll be waiting for you on your TV when you get home. With YouTube TV fully integrated, you need never miss live events. You can record from your phone, as well as get unlimited DVR functionality. You can also play music from your favorite services and in ambient mode, turn your TV into your large digital photo frame showing all the favorite pictures you've taken. It even works with your Nest cameras and doorbells. We will be bringing the Google TV experience to many more streaming devices in the Android TV ecosystem. Today, Google TV is making its debut on the all new Chromecast. To me, the incredible part about Chromecast that we were able to make old TVs new TVs. So something that was antiquated all of a sudden became smart. Millions of people around the world use it every day to cast their favorite movies, shows, and music. The new Chromecast with Google TV builds on everything that people love about Chromecast, and it's the perfect complement to Google TV. And the biggest news here is the addition of a remote to help you navigate with either your finger or your voice. So my favorite button is the assistant button, and that's why we even made it a fun pop color. And with the assistant button, it's so easy. You just press it and you ask it what you want, and it just magically shows up. Even when you say something like, play the great British baking show on Netflix. Remotes can often feel bulky and boxy with too many buttons. And for me, anything you bring into your home should feel like it's a part of your life and your personality, even remotes. The new Chromecast remote has a floating stance that invites you to pick it up, and it comes in three distinct colors that live naturally in their surroundings, snow, sky, and sunrise. We wanted to make the remote as delightful as a bowl of candy. We also have dedicated buttons for today's most popular streaming services like Netflix and YouTube to give you even quicker access to the content that you love. There is so much wonderful content out there and we want to help you find it easily. Think of Google TV as your personal entertainment content curator. And the new Chromecast with Google TV is available today for just $49.99 in the US and it's coming to more countries by the end of this year. It's time for you to get cozy on the couch and let Google help you find what you're looking for. Open YouTube TV.